The problem is to solve. x minus 6 over x plus 5 is greater or equal to 0. We already have 0 on the right side, so the first part of our solution is to identify the zeros of the left side expression and put them on a number line to determine our test regions and label them as positive or negative. So in this case, we get 6 and negative 5. So we need to test to the left of negative 5, in between negative 5 and 6, and to the right of 6. A number we can use to the left of negative 5 is negative 6, and plugging that in, we get a negative over a negative or a positive number. We can use 0 to plug in between our numbers, and we get a negative over a positive or a negative number. Finally, we can use it as 7 as our number greater than 6, and plugging it in, we get a positive over a positive or a positive number. For our solution, we need to find what is greater than or equal to 0. While we can include 6 in this, our denominator cannot be equal to 0, so we will not include our negative 5. So we will be using our positive regions, and we will get negative infinity to negative 5 and 6 to infinity as our final answer.